Welcome to Wisdom Trek with Gramps. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, and we are on day 2093 of our trek. Establishing good habits is imperative for living a godly life. And one habit that I practice nearly every day of the past 45 plus years of my adult life is to read a chapter in the book of Proverbs that corresponds to the day of the month. This single habit has been the catalyst for gaining wisdom and creating a living legacy. Adopting this habit can do the same for your life. The realization that God's wisdom is the only true wisdom drives me to seek out God's wisdom each day. And there's no better way to do this than to meditate on God's book of wisdom. Wisdom is the final frontier in gaining true knowledge. So we are on our daily trek to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, and to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. The Book of Proverbs, Chapter 22 Choose a good reputation over great riches. Being held in high esteem is better than silver or gold. The rich and poor have this in common. The Lord has made them both. The prudent person foresees danger and takes precautions. The simpleton go blindly on and suffer the consequences. True humility and fear of the Lord lead to riches, honor, and long life. Corrupt people walk a thorny, treacherous road. Whoever values life will avoid it. Direct your children onto the right path, and when they are older, they will not leave it. Just as the rich rule the poor, so the borrower is a servant to the lender. Those who plant injustice will harvest disaster, and their reign of terror will come to an end. Blessed are those who are generous, because they feed the poor. Throw out the mocker, and fighting goes too. Quarrels and insults will disappear. Whoever loves a pure heart and gracious speech will have the king as a friend. The Lord preserves those with knowledge, but he ruins the plans of the treacherous. A lazy person claims, There's a lion out there. If I go outside, I might get killed. The mouth of an immoral woman is a dangerous trap. Those who make the Lord angry will fall into it. A youngster's heart is filled with foolishness, but physical discipline will drive it far away. A person who gets ahead by oppressing the poor or showering gifts on the rich will end in poverty. Sayings of the Wise Listen to the words of the wise. Apply your heart to my instruction. For it is good to keep these sayings in your heart and always ready on your lips. I am teaching you, yes you, so you will trust in the Lord. I have written thirty sayings for you, filled with advice and knowledge. In this way you may know the truth and take an accurate report to those who sent you. Don't rob the poor just because you can, or exploit the needy in court. For the Lord is their defender. He will ruin anyone who ruins them. Don't befriend angry people or associate with hot-tempered people, or you will learn to be like them and endanger your soul. Don't agree to guarantee another person's debt or put up security for someone else. If you can't pay, even your bed will be snatched from under you. Don't cheat your neighbor by moving the ancient bounty markers set up by previous generations. Do you see any truly competent workers? They will serve before kings rather than working for ordinary people. And today, as you ponder Proverbs chapter 22, please encourage your friends and family to join us and to come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend, as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek podcast and journal each day. And as we take this trek of life, together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, Listen intentionally, learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and create a great day every day. See you next time for more Daily Wisdom.